I'm Mike Sokol from RV Electricity. I'm in the back lot of my Funkworks lab, and I'm doing an interesting little experiment here. So I wondered what would happen if I had a Jackery 1000 Pro, and I want to use that for emergency power inside. But let's say that the sun's not shining, or it's raining, or I really don't want to set solar panels outside all day. I can actually fast charge it off of a car generator 1000. All I did was I took my car generator 1000 watt unit, hooked it up to my battery, just as I normally would. I've got some extra metering on here. I can see that I'm drawing around 6.6 .6 amps um, on the 120 volt side. I go down to my Jackery 1000, you can see it's charging that up at about 760 watts or so. So it should be able to completely recharge this in just uh, a little over an hour. So if you're in an emergency situation where you've got a rolling blackout or whatever, and you want to be able to take the Jackery inside to run your computers or whatever, and you had a car generator, if you ran the car generator for maybe an hour a day while this is plugged in outside, it would in fact go ahead and completely recharge this Take your Jackery back inside, run your refrigerator, do whatever kind of things that you need to do. And then the next day, you can take your Jackery back out, plug, run your idle your engine for, you know, 60 to 90 minutes and completely recharge it. Because this, this version of Jackery has a built-in 760-watt charger, so it just needs a cord. Of course, I've got extra metering on here and everything so I can see what's going on. Makes sense. 1,000-watt car, car generator. Jackery 1000 Explorer Pro, hook it up to any vehicle, should be able to run it just fine. In an hour to an hour and a half, I'll completely recharge it, and bang, you're all set up, charged up for another day of emergency power in your house. Okay, it's Mike Sokol from RV Electricity at my Funkworks Lab back lot. Thanks for watching.